We often use the expression "your eyes are the windows to your soul" to describe an intimate link between our eyes and our mind. But is this expression just a metaphor, or can we really tell how people think by looking into their eyes? How can we track where people look at? What can we learn from this information? For hundreds of years, scientists are intrigued by the link between our eye movements and the way we see and think about the world. In 1879, a French scientist named Louis Emile Javel studied people's eye movement during reading. He discovered that reading does not involve a smooth sweeping of our eyes along the sentences. Instead, our eyes rapidly jump from one point to another and then make a series of short stops. We call these short stops eye fixations, and the jumping motion saccades. Javel's discovery prompted many interesting questions for scientists. For example. On which words do the eyes stop? For how long? To answer these questions, we need to find a way to track and record people's eye gaze and movement. Armed with modern computer and video technologies, today's eye tracking devices are less intrusive and more accurate. Scientists can use video camera or other specially designated optical sensor to capture the light reflecting from people's eyes. The information is then analyzed to extract our eye position from changes in reflections. Iran's Ahmadinejad wins presidential election. In addition to scientific research on people's cognitive processes, the eye tracking technology can also be used to test the effectiveness of various communication products, such as advertisements, print layout, video games, and television programs. In the Department of Media and Communication, we have recently applied this technology to help with the redesigning of HSBC's website. We're also working with Mingpao and Radio and Television of Hong Kong to improve the usability and design of their websites.